Hi, I'm Jerry Romano and I love to cook. I like food that is easy to prepare and tastes great. Today I'll show you my version of pasta with carbonara sauce. In Rome, it's made with guanciale, which is what I'll be using today. But if you can't find it, it'll still taste great with pancetta. Let's start by turning on a pot of salted water for the pasta. This recipe calls for using a raw egg, and we'll separate the yolk from the white. My research showed that 1 in 20,000 eggs have salmonella, and there's no way to tell if it does. If you aren't comfortable using a raw egg, there are pasteurized eggs available in some food markets. Let's give the pasta a stir to keep it from sticking. I cut the guanciale into chunks, wrap it tight, and keep it in the freezer. It's easier to cut when it's frozen. With the pan on medium heat, add some olive oil and one third cup of diced guanciale. If you don't want the rendered fat from guanciale, strain it and add some extra virgin olive oil to the pan to keep the pasta from sticking. With the pan on medium heat, add about a half a cup of pasta water. Now cook the pasta for about one to two minutes to absorb all those great flavors. Turn off the heat and add about a half a cup of cheese. Your choice, Reggiano, Locatelli, Pecorino, whichever is your favorite, and stir it up. Now it's important that the pan not be that hot when you add the egg whites, because they'll cook. What you want to do is make it into a cream sauce with the cheese and the egg white. Add a generous amount of freshly ground black pepper, and then mix it well. We're almost there. Let's get some pasta and put it in the bowl. Make a nest in the center for the egg yolk. Add the egg yolk. Well, let's have a taste. Mmm, is that good? Well, I wish you could be here to join me for this fantastic meal, but it's time to manja bevy.